In episode 8 of Enigmatica 6 Expert, we find a dungeon made from create casings, we go on a failed treasure hunt, we make the cooking pot and sulphur, uh, plant our first farm, create the crushing wheels, and set them up. Hope you enjoy the episode, let's get it on. And um, I'm not sure whether I've got this on previous video, but if you look here, I've got loads of casings for, from Create and Andesite casings. Um, I actually found, and it's not that far away from me as well, a dungeon that was made up just about entirely of Create casings. And it was just down here, right just there next to that tower. Um, we'll go and have a look at that later. Meanwhile, um, it's uh, back on the uh, trail of um, what I was doing, which is Nature's Aura and um, ours. Uh, now you can see we've got all this set up. Uh, this was to make the crushing wheels to give us more ores. And I think the thing that was holding me back from making the crushing wheels was actually the um, the casings, these casings, brass casings, because I couldn't make this wood um, without doing, you know, um, blood magic and Britannia. But now I can because we found this dungeon. In fact, let's um, oh, stung to death. Ouch, that's painful. Um, let's go and show you that dungeon just so you know what I mean. Um, I'll just sleep for the time being. So, uh, oh, it's down the river, isn't it? I should have brought a boat with me. Did I, did I bring a boat? No, I didn't bring a boat. It's not that far away. It's not that death marker either. Um, so, we've got to go down into the snow. Preferably uh, not running through all the uh, berries and stuff. Also, I'm not sure if I've been to the top of this tower or not. Uh, I've not activated the waystone if I did. So it might be worth going up there. As soon as I can fly. 
kind of. With my um with my flamingo uh, rubber duck thing. No, I haven't. Uh, already got some of those. Slime boots is useful, I guess. Uh, be useful for getting down here, actually. Oh, I've lost my helmet. Uh, yeah, so that's the uh, that's the dungeon there. Boing, 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 boing. Yeah, and look, it's made up of all the casings all the way down. We've got uh, jukeboxes in here. Um, these are all andesite casings in the wall. And you saw the brass casings up at, up, up at the start. There's loads of brass casings down here as well. Uh, there's the brass casings. Uh, and the entire dungeon is... Um, I don't know about that way. I've not been through there, but I came through here and I've actually stripped them all out. All these were casings. Uh, as you can see, there's more here. Andesite casings in the floor. Uh, brass casings all over the place. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. If you find one of these dungeons, then, you know, you're pretty much set. Uh, I've not actually looked any further down, um, but I think it's probably going to be more of the same. Yeah, more casings. I don't know what that spawner is, let's have a quick look. Oh, it's a skelly bob. Now, that um, answers one question about skeletons in armour. Um, I wondered whether that was the initial problem with the um, Optifine and the resource pack. Uh, but looking at that, it's not. Turns on the lights. Have a quick look in here while we're down here. Uh, just a few torches. Why not? Uh, that's not much use. I think there was another one here. here. Oh, take mana steel. I don't know how useful that's going to be. Obliteration 8. Whew. Sounds good. Now well, let's venture a bit further while we're here. Could go down again. Ah, so it's not um, it's not a create unless this is a false floor. No, it's not a false floor. Um, so it's not create blocks everywhere. So we're down to stone. Oh, is that an Enderman spawner? No, I'm never that lucky. Uh, the, the, the other thing is you never know whether these chests are trapped or not. There's no actual indication apart from looking beneath them, of course. Uh, is that a zombie? Yeah, it is. Oh, they're actually coming up from downstairs or in that hole or around the corner. Oh, it could have just been around, I guess. Oh, let's not. Let's not.
Oh, come around. Got pretty much one hit them, but that's uh, that's not the point really. Uh, don't really think phantom membranes have any use, do they? Sleep charms, no. Take the sticks. Take the string. Let's have a look down here. I've not got that many torches, so I can't really go that far. Um, that looks like it intersects with a mine shaft. Yep, does indeed. And I'll take these though. See you there. <laughs> oh, I bet he fell up from from up there. But he fell down. Right, let's go home.
Right, so um, we want to um, get, where are we? We want to get this scarab. And to make that, we need these four items. Um, but for some metal blend, we need sulfur. Ah, uh, right. So it's enchanted ash and coal dust. This is how we get sulfur dust. Um, forget the end, forget everywhere else. So enchanted ash is simply blasting bones. That's easy enough. And then that's just coal dust, uh, which we can either use the hammer for, we can use the crushing wheels. Um, what we do need is a cooking pot and a cooking pot is pretty straightforward apart from the conduit and that's what we were looking for the heart of the sea for and we did find one so um, four shells two lapis two flora and a gem so there's a gem two flora uh, I think it was four lapis was it No, two lapis, two fluorite, and four shells. Uh, I did get a lot more shells. Uh, where I put them is a different matter. I think they're in here, aren't they? Uh, yeah. And then, of course, it's lightning trade, uh, lightning thing. So we'll we'll use one of these snowball effigies. You can't really do it indoors, can you? Don't really want to try, to be honest. Seeing as my house is made of wood. So again, just throw them all on the floor, in a pile, and then right click with the snowball, and it's in our hand. Right, so we just need the other things uh, to make the cooking pot. So, centered stick had already made those. Again, I'm going to have to find them. I think they're in my backpack, actually. Um, no, I took them out. I thought they were. Uh, centered sticks, centered sticks. They are here somewhere. One of these. There. So, we need one of those. Uh, two bricks, copper plates, four iron. I don't know if I made the copper plates or not. I thought I had. Uh, probably not, because they would be in here anyway. Uh, do we have any copper? No, we don't. It's a waste of a cold just putting two in there, but, you know, it is what it is. Uh, why am I putting two in there? Because it's only one copper plate. Doesn't matter. And then all we do with this is drop it on here. Stand back. One copper plate. Uh, clay bricks, uh, oh, actually we can put those in the furnace, can't we? Uh, if we come on where they are here. Let's not waste all that. And then just the four iron ingots uh, to get them here. And we should have ourselves a cooking pot. Now, does this require heat under? More than likely. Yeah, we have. Let's see whether these will do. Hopefully they shouldn't set fire to anything. Uh, let's try that. Does that work? Seems to. Yep, seems to. So now we need the bones for the ash. Oh, what did I just throw out? So, um, how much sulfur do we need? We don't really need one for the time being, but I'll, I'll make some. I'll make more than one. Let's make. Um, like, what's the other stuff that goes with it? Silver dust. Yeah, let's. Um, yeah, let's make one. 
I'm just thinking that we've got our crushing wheels set up, then we're not going to crush away all this, or I'm not going to smelt away all these chunks. Uh, although I think you can just make one for one, yeah, so yeah, it doesn't really make any difference. Uh, so that's one and one. Uh, I think it was uh, blasting, wasn't it? And we need our hammer to crush them. Yep, chanter dash. And then we need uh, coal. Uh, coal. I think two and two. It was two and two, wasn't it? Um, no, one and one. Oh, well, let's go two and two, seeing as we're almost doing that anyway. So you put that into the cooking pot. And that makes your first sulphur. Or sulphur dust in this case. Ta da! Okay, we didn't need two, but let's now go and convert this. Oh, slime boots out. I'm bouncing everywhere. So with this, it's uh, four and one, so we just pop a one, two, three, four, and then one. Not enough sauce. Right, okay, so with this we need to carry on with the um, Ars Nova crystallizer. Go back to the R's quests. And we need these over here. So um, we were going to go... Now there's two quest lines. There's that one there and then I think... Is it this one here? Yeah, this one here requires you to make the um, agronomic source link. Now the agronomic, I believe, is the one where you uh, kill mobs to gain source. Um, agro, agronomic. From the soil springs forth a great source of energy. Tap into it, begin down the path of sorcery. Natural tree and plant growth in the vicinity will release some excess source. Oh, right, okay. So, <laughs> it's not really a good name, is it? Agro. You'd think it would be mob one, so this is a plant one. So, let's make this. Um, we need another conduit. Of course we do. And we need arcane gold. Now, I was looking back at one of my other videos about Arcane Gold, and we definitely picked some up. I'm just not sure what we did with it. So, we must have used it for something. Um, so, Agro Nom. Right. So, we're making this now. So, Phyto Grow. Got some of that somewhere. Should have been in there, but it's not. Because I've got stuff absolutely everywhere. Is it in these? Yes. So there's the Phyto Grow. We need to make um, another conduit. Let's do that first. Oh no! Need another Heart of the Sea. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, and I don't have another one. Um, how do you make these things anyway? It's this, isn't it? Um, I don't know how you get spirit fire. Throw my demon's dream fruit to the ground and light it on fire. Demon. I've got some of those seeds, actually. I do have... I don't know where I got them from. Uh, demon... Yeah, there, look. 55 of them. Let's see whether we can just grow these. Um... A bucket of water. Where are my... Oh, there's a bucket of water. I'll do. Oh, of course it's night time. Why wouldn't it be? Whoa! Okay, this skeleton is after... 
the dog. Where did that uh, creeper go? So, we, we can come to a bridge with one stone here. If we plant near to here, so let me get some more soil. See whether I can make it daytime. Oh, we should be able to get sorted that, isn't it? Just hope these seeds are not something that uh, grow something bad. Because we, we don't really want that. In fact, do they even plant in this? They don't. Right, okay. Uh, let's just plant uh, three rows for now because we don't need that many. Uh, we can plant food in the others, seeing as uh, we have not got a great deal of food. See what food seeds we can plant. Um, well, I'm guessing we'll go with wheat then. So spirit fire, throw a demon dream fruit to the ground and light it on fire. And then throw magic clay in to get arcane ashes. One would presume that's um, what you do with it. And I didn't see mana powder there either. So that oh, that's actually easy to get. Oh, you don't need Britannia for that. You just hit one of the source gems. Or oh, crush. Right, so while they're growing, let's do the crushing wheels. We'll get those set up. Uh, crushing wheels are a pretty big recipe. So how many and uh, that's uh, 3, 7, 9, 10, 13, 16 and alloy. Uh, which should be in this chest. I haven't got enough. Uh, we need one of those. Four casings, was it? Four? Yeah. Um, so we need some more andesite alloy. Um, andesite, andesite in here. Yeah. And we just blow up um, andesite and iron. Um, how much iron do we want to blow up? Let's blow up 28. Take something to blow it up with. Uh, let's go far enough away. Don't have to fill the hole in. So, place TNT, throw that down, throw. Oh, how we managed to get. Throw that down and then blow it up. And that should give us and a side alloy. We will follow because I'm good like that.
Well, these boots, uh, these cosmetic boots that uh, were found are very good. Super fast, super speedy. I'm wondering what they are. They are these running shoes. Increase movement speed and step height while sprinting. They were in there, weren't they? It's just. Um, I've used them all. Right, so. Uh, back to crushing wheels. So, andesite alloy. Uh, we need to turn this off, otherwise, it will. Uh, it will craft. And. Will that turn off? No. Something we can turn off just here. I thought that gearbox. We'll turn off. Let's just break. Oh, we set this up. It'd be easy just to break that. Break that axle. So we go all the way, all the way around the outside. And then I believe on the corners. Yeah. One, two, three, four, and then you've got four casings. Three, four, and then the rod in the middle and then that should if I've done it right pop out just here yep like that lovely right uh, I'm to need to knock this away from um, this away some more I think I will put them there Let's be honest, they're not going to fit anywhere else just here. Uh, let's see if we got an axe that we can chop away this wall with. I'm sure I've picked more than one axe up. That one will do. Swap you for the hoe. Give yourself a bit of room behind here. be enough room so um oh, will they actually fit just here that's the next question let's just see uh probably probably there is gonna have to be one don't think can go i mean i could knock away that th these three here i guess and um, we can put one there um if the other fits just there yeah, they'll have to go there like that, so that should clear. Yeah, that's not catching on there, so that's fine. So we'll put those three back. Uh, we'll leave the top and the bottom. Can I still get past? Yeah. Uh, we'll just remove that block. Let's put the gearbox up here of that one uh, where are we we're up there and we need to be oops Can that go from there to there it will and I believe that's spinning correctly yep will do nicely 128 SU we don't anyway I'll tidy that up at a later date let's um let's get a couple of shoots uh under sight and iron plates that makes four so a couple of iron plates a couple of under sight make the plates need to get above. So shoot there for in. 
Uh, I think we've got some hoppers actually to catch the output. Uh, I'm sure hoppers work just as good. chest to drop them into. To get rid of that. This might hurt. Uh, let's go to Whale. Uh, what should we cook up first? Let's do, um, let's drop the iron chunks in there. Um, we don't drop them in there, do we? We actually have to physically drop them in. So we can use a chest on top, I believe that will work, but that's not going to open because that block's in the way. So that should work. 